The Silver Arrows arrived back in Formula One, bringing with them the most successful driver of all time. But not even the combination of Mercedes and Michael Schumacher was enough, and it was young teammate Nico Rosberg who put them back on the podium. Disappointment summed up the start of testing in 2011, with Paddock Gossip claiming Mercedes were struggling. But by the final test, the turnaround was obvious. Ross said to us in the beginning, he was like, guys, it's going to be a very slow start because we're going to work on reliability and everything, and then we're going to put on performance in the end. There was a lot of work to do over the winter, a lot of work to do over those tests, but none of it was, was uh, different to what we, we'd planned. We had a good preparation uh, for the car. That uh, first priority, obviously, was the readability. We start to think, OK, well, can you just please put on some performance now? The car had been predicted uh, to be exactly where it was in Barcelona. And that's the positive. Our weakness last year, that during the year, our development was, was lacking a bit. Last year we had some trouble with predicting where we wanted to be and achieving this. Now when they say um, we're going to put six tenths of performance on the car with this and this bit, whereas last year often that wouldn't then be the case because there would be various problems and things like that, and this winter it went on the car and it was the six tenths. It's exciting for us to follow our predictions and, and actually match them and uh, put them into lap times. We know from the very first race how we're going to work with the drivers. I know Michael very well, but of course the team didn't. This year, compared to last year, it's a, a big difference because I, I just arrive and I know immediately who is responsible for what. Every year we want to do better, so ultimately we can win the championship. Whether we win it uh, in one year, two years, three years, I don't know, but we must go forward every year. Will we win the championship? I don't think so. I don't think we yet prepared for fighting uh, the championship. If everything goes very well, we might win a race. The ultimate goal needs to be that we need to be the quickest car and just win races out of pure pace. There is good possibilities that we run onto the podium and that's what I'm expecting and hope for even at the first race.